kind of a lot more interesting to see what what you develop can actually do. So mangroves are a really important coastal tree species and then they provide a lot of important ecological co contribution. Uh, baseball means a lot to me. It really has a special place in my heart. I've been playing since I was uh, four years old and it's really part of my identity. This is my baseball fan. <laughs> My research revolves around how politicians are utilizing Twitter and talking to their constituents. Baseball is a non-contact sport, but surprisingly you see just as many injuries in baseball as you see in other sports. A lot of things that we used to use to kind of track things in the mangroves are kind of honestly primitive. I, I think me and Kathy have both experienced using yeah. them. What we do now is we kind of just fly drones over it. Drone data provides a lot more accurate data for um, when we're calculating biomass. So if you've seen the movie Moneyball or read the book, you know that they're using statistics in order to build good baseball teams on low budgets. In my case, I'm using statistics in order to see if I can predict injuries. Through transfer and machine learning, we were able to uh, see how politicians are tweeting nowadays, and they're really utilizing more opinionated and negative statements in their uh, tweets. So one of my favorite things about this project is that it's so interdisciplinary. So then you have this um, lab that's working at Scripps Institute of Oceanography, and you have another lab that's from the CSC department, and then they're working together to solve one problem. I ran into a lot of issues uh, regarding how to process a lot of the data that we're uh, working with. It was a really large data set, and we really had to allocate a lot of uh, resources through Google and through some other um, uh, on-site uh, UCSD's uh, resources. I think the, the big difficulty with this project was getting the data set uh, nice and organized and in a format that I could write code to run on. Eventually I was able to get the data set to how I wanted it to be. It's not just me dealing with a bunch of images, it's me going into the mangroves and having to feel what they are, getting stuck like waist deep in mangroves. So then after that, doing all the machine learning stuff, it just makes it a lot more valuable to me. I really enjoy being part of the HDSI Fellowship that provide a lot of different resources for my project, but I also got to see a variety of other undergraduate students using data science to accomplish their goals as well. It's really interesting work, and I get to work with a lot of people that I've never worked with, uh, really getting to learn more about politics in general, and getting to work with great professors like uh, Professor Thad Kowser here. I really love what I'm doing. I'm uh, working with baseball, which is something I'm really passionate about. It's nice to know that it's doing something. Yeah, it's it's exactly. helping people's lives. It's, mm -hmm. you know, helping fight global warming and all the fun stuff like that. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. awesome. Cool. Thanks, thanks, thank you all.